Hi, it's Sean Wanda here with Blue Cow Marketing, back with another helpful marketing tip. This one again using Facebook. Have you heard of Creator Studio? Well, if you haven't, don't worry, because not many people have, but if you've come across it, you're pretty sure it's a pretty cool interface. So you see this on the screen, this is Creator Studio. But first, before we go into what it is, how do you get it? So go into your Facebook page. So we're just gonna walk back here through how to get there. So you're going to get into the, the admin settings and you're going to go to the settings section. And then once you're in here, you're going to scroll down and you're going to choose instant articles. Once you do that, you're going to be taken to this publishing tool section. From in here, you can choose under the tools, Creator Studio. Now, once you're there, it's gonna open in another tab, and here's the point where I suggest that you bookmark this, that's what we did. This is just a nice, clean interface for you to manage your page or any other page that you have, because you can choose them from the drop down here and choose other pages that you manage if you are an agency. But in essence, what it's doing is it's giving you the option to you know, post new content, so you can go ahead and you can post to different pages uh, that you uh, manage. You can upload a video, you can go live, you can search for content within your timeline right here. But then on the left hand side, you can check out the content library. So this is basically any of the posts that have been created um, by you on the different pages. So you can go through and you can see all the different content that's here. So if you want to look at, you know, let's say that here's one that's got uh, some graphics in it. Uh, you can see the stats on that specific post. If it's a, a video, let's see if we can find one here that might have a video um, that we've uploaded. Here's one. All right, so here's a tutorial video we did before. It's showing us uh, three second views, 10 second views, all this kind of stuff. Uh, you can create a post with this video. You can edit this post or you can boost it right from here. You can see the other posts, the other shares. A lot of great metrics here when you're managing your page. Then you get into the insights. Now you can see certain things and we'll, we'll break this open a little bigger here. Uh, let's do this quarter, oh, let's do the full quarter here. Um, so you got performance numbers, you've got loyalty numbers in here so you can go through and see the different um, insights based on your page. You got earnings if you're running ads and collecting that data. But really under performance is where you're gonna see a lot of the information uh, that you wanna notice. For example, different videos, dot, or top pages that are out there um, as well. So if you wanted to add in um, other content, you can do it at any point here on the right hand side. The other thing is you've got options for your inbox. I'm not going to click on it because there is some client information in ours uh, that we don't want to release here in this video, but it allows you to manage all your inbox messages there as well monetization. So if you've got your page set up to be eligible for monetization, uh, tools, then you're going to be able to do that here. Uh, rights manager, sound collections, uh, and preferences. So you can go in here and, and uh, add different people to your page. Uh, and again, see the different sound collections and, and audio libraries that are available within your page. So it's uh, Creator Studio by Facebook. Check it out. I think it's a really nice, clean interface for you to manage your Facebook page.